this is our magic knife for slicing the salmon. Um, we've got the bar at the bottom that allows me to make sure that the slice is exactly the same throughout as we cut it, as you'll see. Okay. So that bar makes sure that the size is exactly the same. Okay. So we're just going to keep slicing. And these are what we're going to use for our rolls. So they're my prime cuts. Now what I want to do with the salad, rather than using the prime cut, I'm going to make use the tail to make the cut up. So we're just going to take this off, very simple, just run your knife at an angle because we don't want the skin. Okay, so that's all we're going to use. It just comes off quite easily and we don't need that anymore. So from the tail piece of the salmon, we're just going to slice it into thin pieces. Now take your time when you're doing this, it's not a race. And then we're going to cut again, nice even little squares. I prefer to do this by hand and not in a true true process because what happens then you create a mousse. I don't want that, I want to keep the integrity of the salmon. So I'm just going to practice our knife skills a little bit. And we're just going to run the knife through nice and slowly, gentle rocking motions to create lovely little cubes. So when you're eating that, you're going to get that bite of the salmon. As I say, when you use the food processor, it's more of a smooth paste and I don't really want that. And I'm just going to run my knife through that one more time. Because I want to keep that salmon flavour true, all I'm going to add, as I say, is a little bit of acidity from the tapio lime and a bit of salt from the, uh, from the capers. That also adds a bit of acidity as well. And what the acidity does, it just cuts through the richness of the salmon. I'm going to come back to our smoked salmon that we cut earlier. Okay. Now we want to tidy this up a little bit, so I'm just going to cut this into small, into small ribbons. Kind of tidy up the edges a little bit. This can all go into your tata. Don't throw it away. The new idea is I want the same size little strips. That's what I'm looking for. Then all I'm going to do with this, I'm just going to roll it. It's very simple. 